office. Now we came as a group. These teachers have been waiting over the last four weeks for the leave entitlements to be sorted out for the Christmas holidays. They have been fronting up at the education office last week only to be directed to a travel agent. If tomorrow we come back and they say it's not cleared, then our Christmas will not be a Merry Christmas. What they really want answered is why the directive given by then Education Minister James Marape was not followed by the Morobe Education Board. Next year, their leave pays will be part of the uh, closing year salaries. Uh, uh, that we, so we put it in with, with the salary and they get it with the salary instead of fronting up and waiting and queuing up so that teachers can design and plan the leaves with the family earlier. Till today, this hasn't eventuated and we are very frustrated. The problem has been ongoing for the last three years. Leave fares have been paid to a third party travel agent and certain amounts of money have been deducted from the entitlements. For teachers receiving 10,000 kina and below, 12% have been deducted and those receiving 20,000 kina and above were deducted 20% of the entitlements. This is not a, a loan we are making. We've worked hard two years for this. It is, it is a hard-end uh, entitlement. It's not just um, a token of appreciation here. We are talking about what we have swear our guts out for. They also questioned why the travel agent was deducting huge sums of money from them. Many teachers say leave forms were submitted in August and to wait for another four months is uncalled for the education board. Today, these teachers were told that their entitlements will be cleared by tomorrow. If not, many of them will wait until next year. Vice Minister for Education and former Bumayong Secondary School Principal Gizu Atsiniwin has blamed this problem on corruption. Morobe Governor Kelly Naru also said the same sentiments, questioning why this problem has been ongoing in Morobe province for many years. Our attempts to speak to the acting provincial education advisor were unsuccessful. Sylvester Gawi, National MTV News, Lay.